Hey guys, Henry here from Product Creation Formula. In this video, we're going to be talking about a free alternative to Vidnami called InVideo. But before we go ahead and do that, I just want to let you know that here at Product Creation Formula, we love to give you tips and tricks to be able to help you create your products quickly and easily. Along with that, we also do product reviews as well as tips on how to make money online. So if that's the sort of thing that interests you, how about you smash that like button as well as subscribe and hit the bell icon so you can be notified whenever we upload more videos. Okay guys, let's go check it out. Okay, now here we are over at NVIDIA. Let's go and have a look at the pricing plan. I'm just going to go straight to the pricing plan because I want to show you that you can actually get it for free without any watermarks and you can use it for quite for pretty much forever as well as long as you want it's not a free trial I mean although if you were to upgrade to the $15 plan they will have a seven day free trial that you can do and it's $180 a year but if you wanted to just make YouTube videos or something like that you can just use this one here which is your free plan and it's called in video now let's have a quick look at how this is done now you can choose from the pre-made templates if you wish to or which is they have 4,000 pre-made templates or you can go to text to video which is the one I'm going to be choosing from because it's got 50 themes but that's okay I just want to go with the themes and I'm going to scroll down here to find one that I think will work well and I think I might choose this one this one looks good I think I'll just choose this one here I like the color theme I like how it looks there it's a nice widescreen and we can use this template just here now the first thing I can do is go grab our text so I've got this one here and I was just Create your day is what this one's called. So let's just copy that. We'll add that to the headline just there. Now I have already separated these up like this. Now it's good to make sure that you have lines between each sentence. The reason why is it just makes it easier for the AI to pick up on what's going on. You go there, you know, go control V, and then we can go next. Now it might take a moment or two for it to go through this but you know we'll have to I'll, I'll pause the video while it's doing that okay so here we are we can this has got a terrible tune to it I think we'll change the tune a little bit later if we go through oh, I don't like that tune whatsoever so what we're going to do is I'm going to go over here to the videos and we'll have a look at what's going on so but you can have a look through here and you can choose to add images here by doing this you can go to the video section and what I would suggest you do is you click on that and you click on that and that will only give you the free options that you can throw over here do you tend to let the outer circumstances set the tone of for each day so you might want to go out here look for outer circumstances uh, yep, let's have a look here. Let's press play, see what this one's like. Yeah, that's fine. Or you can choose video from down here. And you can go from there. So, that looks kind of unusual. Yeah, I might grab that one and pop it in here. Now let me show you what happens here. You see you've got an image just there. We may have to trim this video to fit the scene. I'm going to hit done. Now what I'm going to do at this particular point is I'm going to delete the one above it. Otherwise it will flash up on the screen first and just be really confusing. So we'll just leave that one as is. And we'll go down to the next one. And then all you have to do is go through each scene and see what they're about. Pause F1. Do you allow other people and events to trigger feelings of anger? Let's write down here anger. We can type down here anger. 
and hit enter don't hit upload or they'll expect you to upload a video so I'm going to grab this one drag it over here and then once it's finished doing the trimming we can then go done and we can delete that one and we can press play Do. So I'm just going to very. I'm just going to pause the video here right now, and go through this and go through all the scenes and change it up. I've got 27 scenes to edit, so I'll just do each scene as I go. All right. Okay, now that we're back, let's go have a look over here where it says Advanced Editor. We can click on that. We're just going to pause the video while it's looking for the Advanced Editor, and then when we do that, we'll come back. Okay, well that didn't take long, we're back now. One of the things we need to look at doing is adding a voiceover. Now to do that, we need to go over to the advanced editor. All we need to do is hit, hover over the top over here, you see where it says voiceover. Now you can do automated text to speech. You can import from uploads. You can upload it your own voiceover, or you can do your own recording. But in this particular case, we're gonna be automated text to speech. You click on that. Now you have options over here. Now we can scroll down and we can choose which one you want to do. I'm going to choose Matthew. And then we hit generate voiceover. Now what's going to happen is it's going to give us an option down here. We can go auto add automated voiceover for all scenes. And then you click add automated voiceover. And what will happen is it will add the voiceover for every one of the scenes that you have on the timeline. And this will take a few minutes, so let's just pause the video until then. Okay, so what I just did in this particular case, I noticed that the voiceover was being drowned out by the music. So I went over, I clicked on this timeline just here, I hit edit, and then I was able to drag this down to 8%, which is what is recommended if you want to have a YouTube video, if you're going to be putting music in the background. This way it doesn't drown out the voice. Now let's press play. Let's press play. Do you tend to let your outer circumstances set the tone for each day? Do you tend to let your outer circumstances? When you do this, you are not using the power you have available to you. Do you allow other people and events to trigger feelings of anger, frustration, impatience, and more? By using the law of attraction, you can turn every day into a great day. One way to do that is by using intentions and visualization to create your day. When you first wake up in the morning, spend 10 minutes or so thinking about the types of things you'd like to experience the day. How so that is basically all you really need to do. Once you're happy with what you've got, you just download it. And then you can then, if you want to do any tweaks or anything like that, you can then upload that, one, put it in your editor, do the tweaks, and then you can upload it straight to your desktop or should I say to YouTube now another thing we might want to do before we download it is to change the music so let's go over here to this one you've got choices from rock you can do chill out you can do mood music you can do angry serious playful inspiring let's go inspiring see what that's like listen to this one Well, I like that one. Pause that. Let's replace music. Hit that. And that will hopefully replace the music for everything. This will replace all background music in the project. Yes, we will continue. And as it goes through, we'll just pause the video while we're waiting for this to be completed. And then we can take the timeline over here press play and hopefully it will have still picked up on all the voices and still reduce the volume click on there I want to reduce the volume of course but we'll see what happens let's just press play before I reduce the volume see what happens see if it reduces it for me create your day 
you tend to let your outer circumstances set the tone for each day? When you do this. Okay, so I've just noticed something here. Let's go back, quickly go back to the storyboard. There was one I didn't delete properly. Should be the second or third frame down. We'll have a look. We'll have a quick look here. This one here. Yeah, let's go add a video to this one. When you do this, you're not using the power you have available. Let's go power and see what comes up with. Let's not have that one and get rid of that one. And we can just hit enter because I really don't like that one. It makes no sense. Okay, we can go like that. We'll drag that across to there. That's it. We'll just hit done and we can now remove that and we can now go back to the advanced editor. So once again, we'll just pause that until it's finished and then we can continue on from there. Okay, now let's press play and see what we can do. See how this is going to go. Now this might have a bit of a difference to what it should be when we download it, but we'll find out. It's a bit laggy because I'm recording at the same time of doing this. And it's still doing its thinking and so forth and replacing various items. Let's go back here. Press play. Create your day. Create your day. Do you tend to let your outer circumstances set the tone for each day? When you do this, you are not using the power you have available to you. Do you allow other people and events okay. to trigger feelings of anger? Finish. Now let's download and share. Click on that. Okay, now as you can see, all you need to do from here is you can download. If you want to go high definition, like 1080p, you can do that. But for, for YouTube, 720 is fine. And you can also directly upload it straight to YouTube. Or you can send it to Facebook or Twitter or one of the other ones, Facebook community. And you can download it as that one, or you can do it as a square one, which would be good for something like Instagram. Or you can do that one, which is probably good for Facebook. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Now, that's all there is for this particular video. Now, if you like this video, please consider smashing the like button, as well as subscribing and hitting the bell icon, so you can be notified whenever we upload more videos. Hey, and while you're at it, why don't leave a comment down below and let me know if you know of any other AI just like this, which can be an alternative to places like Vidnami and all those other paid places. And if you do, let me know. I'll check them out. And I'll, if there's any good, I'll review it. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. And oh, and also, if you like this video, why not share? Thanks, guys. Bye for now.